Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you guys are near, hi, hi, my name is Kyle. Uh -huh. Hey, um, so I just want to come on here and let you guys know that this is a disclaimer. I do use profanity in this video, and if you don't feel comfortable watching profanity, um, this is not the video for you to watch. Just wanted to let you know. Yeah, and I don't feel like editing out because that's just how I talk on a normal basis, but I just don't talk like that in front of my family. But that's how I'm going to talk in social media because that's how I am. So, um, I hope you guys enjoy the video. All right. Hey guys, how are you? Don't be mad at me. Don't, don't be mad at me. I know, I, I know. I, I, I've been gone. I abandoned you. I left you. <laughs> so, um, quick thing about me. Um, my name is Kyle. I, uh, I am, I'm that bitch. And I like coffee. That's all me. So this video is pretty much just five things I wish I know before coming out into the gay community. I'm not gonna hold up too much longer, let's just jump into this video. Okay, so the first thing I really wish I knew before coming out as bi in the gay community is that a lot of people think they're entitled to certain things. For instance, like when I came out as bi, people really thought it was okay to tell me that I wasn't bi. Like, first of all, I like what I like. I like females and I like males. Like one, the baddest bitch Zendaya. Two, the finest nigga. <laughs> well, there's a couple of them. Kyle, they might not be wrong. But still, there are bad bitches and there are just fine ass niggas and bad bitches. So you can't make me choose. So that's one thing that I really hated because it's like, you can't tell me what I like and who I am. Like baby, I define who I am. Nobody else can define me and that's just how it is. So whatever I like is what I like. Okay, the second thing I really wish I knew before coming out as bi in the community, gay community is that the DLs, baby, where the hood niggas at because them DLs are crazy. Let me tell you, you will get DLs in your DMs probably like at least every other day or at least every day for like the first couple of months because they you're like first meet to them you have two types of deals you have the deals who are i'm um, going to bash you because they can never be who you are they can never be the baddest bitch okay they can never they can never because they're still in the closet but like i mean there's also those deals who like are scared to because like they're like, like their current living situation, like they can't come out because the people who they're living with are probably homophobic, so they can't really say anything. And like, if they do, they're gonna get kicked out their house, you know what I'm saying? So you have different types of DLs. So like, you'll get a mixture of different DLs. So like, you have the DLs like in high school, you have the DLs who they'll act all hard in front of their straight friends and be like, oh my God, look at that fucking Like bitch, shut the fuck up. You Like shut the hell up. You know, so you will have certain deals like that. You have the DLs who want to keep it strictly outside the school and you have certain deals who want to keep it inside the school. But baby, I don't really got to worry about myself getting caught up. All right, so the third thing I wish I knew is that people will try to be extremely friendly with you just so they can get at you, if that makes sense. So when I first came out as bi back in February, Back in February of 2020, so I came out like a whole year ago, and what I like, people would actually try to be friendly with me so they can hit at me and use me. Does that make sense? Like, I gotten used before because of my confidence of when I first came out. I got used. They will try to take away from you. Like, they'll try to make you less confident as you were before. They will either try to bring you down as a person, they'll make you feel bad about yourself. Just know that when you come out it's gonna build your character and there's gonna be people in your life that want to see you do good and there's gonna be some people who want to bring you down in the dirt with them because they don't have the confidence you have because like i said you are that bitch the fourth thing is baby that after coming out glow up that you have it is serious it is so serious like let me tell y'all like let, let's bring it up like i really want to get into that post glow up of a whole year baby a whole year like where i was a year ago is where i'm not at now like hold on we are going to bring this shit up nigga before i came out i looked like this 
And then, a year later, I look like this. That, that post coming out glow up, it, it is serious. They don't play no games. The gods, they knew you were a bad bitch. They give you that motherfucking confidence. They knew you were born to be a fucking star. The fifth thing I really wish I knew before coming out as bi in the gay community is that you're an amazing person. You have this awesome confidence that certain people do not have yet built because you came out when you wanted to come out. Some people are not ready to come out. Some people are ready to come out. You just never know, but you have that confidence some people kind of lack right now so that's something that you should feel great about yourself and then i want you to also remember and be aware that some people are not going to agree with your option of your sexuality and that's totally fine because that's a lie for them to believe in their head and you don't want to live a lie rather than be happy because i hope that makes sense choose your happiness over other people's happiness because what makes them happy is not gonna make you happy and i just i want y'all to understand that and like don't live a lie for anybody else live to your truth and live to your full truth because honestly that's the best thing that's gonna happen for you all right guys that's the end of the video today i hope you guys really enjoyed this video because i enjoyed making this video make sure you hit the subscribe button down below it is free make sure you hit that like button down below and if you don't already go follow me on all my social medias my snapchat my instagram Instagram and my TikTok. It will be all linked down below and up on the screen. But yeah, so I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye!